guys, today I'm going to show you guys how to winterize a, a gunnera plant. Uh, so uh, a gunnera plant is those uh, really large uh, looking tropical plants that uh, you know are fantastic here in the region I live on the west coast of Canada uh, during the summer months and the spring months, but in the winter it just gets far too cold for them uh, and they will most likely die if you uh, leave them uh, without winterizing them. So what is winterizing? Well basically uh, all it entails is cutting all of the stalks and leaves uh, off of the plant and just leaving the center uh, stump or root ball uh, and then taking all of the stems off of those large gigantic leaves uh, throwing those out but then saving the leaves and turning them all upside down on top of that uh, center root ball or root stalk uh, to keep it protected from any winter frost or snow uh, and that's basically it you just pile up all the leaves around it uh, and just keep it protected uh, from that winter frost and it'll survive as long as uh, it doesn't have uh, you know any direct contact uh, with that winter frost uh, so let's get started <music> I'm just using a serrated blade here. Uh, it's the top of a pruning pole uh, blade. Uh, one of those uh, large telescoping uh, pruning poles that you can get and you find the serrated blade. This is just an old one. Works great for this. You can cut through the thick stalks or just slice through them uh, like a machete uh, with this particular uh, type of tool. So these areas here of the plant, as well as these here, is what you want to protect from the winter frost, is these uh, center stumps. So I'm going to take all of those leaves after and pile up around these areas to uh, insulate all of this.
yeah so as you saw there uh, I was using uh, a whole bunch of debris uh, dry leaves that sort of stuff uh, as extra insulation extra mulch uh, just to cover on top of those large pink uh, you know seed heads flower heads there uh, for next spring so the key here is basically just to insulate them keep them out of that direct uh, frost uh, and just give them that buffer zone uh, so that they stay away from uh, uh, you know the frost uh, actually uh, you know building up on the actual plant. So you can see the finished product here. I'm just completely covering the base and roots of those gunnera plants. Just to keep them insulated. All the debris, anything you have, just pile it up around them. Underneath them, around them, you saw me dumping the bags of leaves all around the bases. back side and that's about it that'll keep them uh, alive throughout the winter so there you have it guys that's how you winterize uh, granera it's quick and easy uh, as you saw there uh, the customer uh, brought out some bags of dry leaves for me that she's been saving uh, and wanted me to put those uh, on top of uh, the uh, root balls uh, first before uh, putting uh, the leaves on top um, it's just an extra precaution uh, the last time we did it last year uh, we just went with the regular leaves and the plant survived uh, but she just wanted to uh, you know take that extra precaution uh, because it's one of her favorite plants here um, so I just poured those leaves on top uh, just to add that extra layer of insulation uh, you know anything you have that you can mulch around the base and just to keep uh, like I said keep that buffer zone uh, so that the plant that root ball itself is not getting exposed uh, to the frost itself uh, and just uh, keeping that extra layer and the plant will do uh, just fine so uh, if you like this video make sure you hit that like button if you haven't subscribed yet consider subscribing leave a comment down below let me know uh, if you have to winterize gunnera or any other type of plant uh, in the region that you work in uh, so that's it for this one guys here's to wishing you guys all overwhelming success and freedom in your lawn care business bye for now